Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hello everyone, first of all, let me introduce myself My name is Robyan Warshaputra My season ID number is A5102102261 I'm a college student at Muhammadiyah University of Surakarta Majoring in Primary School Teacher Education Today we are going to talk about uh, My presentation on Green Lab as a form of explorative learning uh, the first slide, introduction. The benefits of Green Lab as a form of exploratory learning. The first point is education is crucial in building an intelligent and cultured generation. Education plays a vital role on shaping individuals and societies. It equips students with knowledge, skills, and values necessary for personal and societal development. Point two. Governments and educational institutions foster innovative and effective learning methods. They continuously strive to improve the quality of education. Their aims to provide students with engaging and impactful learning experience. Point three, explorative learning is a popular learning method. It, it encourages students to explore their ideas, arguments, and way of thinking. Open educations are used to stimulate critical thinking and creativity. Point four, environmental learning model is Natural School and Green Lab. Natural School adopts an environmental-based education system, and Green Lab is a learning method within Natural Schools, incorporating natural and artificial laboratories. Point five, environmental learning mod model enhances student experience and reduces cost. Students learn through direct experience of the environment. And all learning resources are provided by nature, so there's almost no cost. Point six. Green Lab supports exploratory learning through various facilities, methods, and learning media. It offers a range of tools and resources to facilitate exploration and discovery. Examples include the Janus board game, inquiry labs methods, Mathlet GeoGebra and the probing prompting model. Point seven, Green Lab benefits students understanding memory and creativity. It strengthens students' comprehension and retention of the material. The hands-on approach caters to kinesthetic learners and fosters creativity and innovation. Point eight, teachers play a crucial role as mentors in the learning process. They guide students in problem solving and provide effective support. Teachers facilitate optimal learning outcomes for students. Point nine, the study focuses on the benefits of Green Lab at SD Muhammadiyah Alam Surya Mantari. The research explores the utilization, management, and advantages of Green Lab. It aims to demonstrate how Green Lab promotes students' optimal development and entails care for that environment. Point 10. The last point. Green Lab fosters optimal student development and environmental, environmental conditions. Green Lab contributes to students' creativity, innovation, and care for the environment. Utilizing Green Lab in education enhances the overall learning experience and outcomes. Second slide is my methodolo methodology on this research. Well, this research uses qualitative, qualitative methods. Qualitative research has various approaches that allows researchers to choose according to the research subject according to USAMTO 2020, 2020. The subject in the in this study is one of the teachers who plays a role in managing the Green Lab and acts as a team of facilities and infrastructure. In this qualitative research, researchers use data collection techniques which were carried out through direct observation at the location of SD Muhammadiyah Alam Surya Mentari and interviews with teachers who handle the, fil the fields of infrastructure so that the data collected corresponds 
to the real condition in the field. Data validation, data, data validation techniques in the study use technical triangulation and qualitative data analysis techniques, use data reduction, data presentation, and data conclusion. Third slide, results and discussions. Well, the benefits of, it, the benefits of Green Lab as experiential learning. The point one, concept of Green Lab and its alignment with nature based on education. Green Lab at SD Muhammadiyah Alam Surya Mentari share similarities with nature-based schools. It utilizes the school's environment as a learning resource, promoting a deeper understanding of subjects. It supports the concept of nature-based education that utilizes natural resources in the school surroundings, according to Ningrum and Purnama, 2019. Point two, Green Lab as a form of exploratory learning. Green Lab offers exploratory learning ex experience for students. Students engage in activity that involves exploring and observing various aspects of nature, according to Fadila 2022. Enhance students' direct interaction with the environment and foster scientific understanding and observation skills. Point 3. Benefits of Green Lab for students Direct and deeper understanding. Students learn through practic pra practical experiences and field observation enhancing their comprehension of the subject matter. And the second is skill development. Students develop observation, explore, exploration, and creativity skills through hands-on activities in the Green Lab. The third one is memorable experiences. Green Lab provides a unique and enjoyable learning environment, leaving a lasting impression on students. Point four. Positive response from students and parents. Students show enthusiasm and engagement during Green Lab activities. Parents appreciate the cost effective nature of Green Lab as it utilizes natural resources without additional expenses. Last one challenges and the role of teachers. Teachers play a crucial role in the successful Im implementation of Green Lab. Well, the challenges include uh, ensuring the integration of curriculum competencies and uh, proper preparation to align with school cur curriculum. Last slide. Conclusion. In conclusion, Green Lab at Asimo Modi Halam Surya Mentari offers significant benefits for students in the learning process. It enhances their observation and exploration skills, foster creativity, and provides memorable experiences. As a form of explorative learning, Green Lab allows uh, students to directly engage the, with nature and the surrounding environment, going beyond traditional learning methods like books and presentations. However, the integration of curriculum competencies uh, presents a challenge for the teacher, emphasizing the need for true preparation and references expansion. Well, overall, the utilization of Green Lab in education at SD Muhammadiyah Alam Syara Mentari creates a more enjoyable, meaningful, and effective learning experience for students. Okay guys, I think that's it for me. I hope it helps. And wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.